Hey, this is Rick from Outdoor Emergencies at Hiking Emergency Beacon. And today I want to tell you how to extend your battery life on your Garmin GPS Map 67i. But before I do that, please like, subscribe, share, and turn on notifications so you'll be alerted as soon as I put out new videos. Now I've done another video with the 66i where I told you how to extend the battery life. This is very similar, but you'll see in the right hand corner here at the top, you'll see the video on how to do that with the 66i. But if you have the 67i, there is one difference and I'll run through those real quick. This will be a very short video and I know you're gonna be really happy about that. Now I haven't tested this out with the 67i. I have gone through five battery tests on this 67i. And again, you're gonna see that in a playlist here in the top right also about the battery life and how I've tested it about five different ways. But what I really wanna tell you here is, if you want to save your battery or extend your battery life on the 67i, here's how you do it. Now, I'm going to read from my list of here things that I've looked up, and I've tried these before, but again, just let me read these to you so you can see. I'll put screenshots up of everything so you can see the different ways to extend your battery life on the 67i. All right, the first way is to reduce the backlight brightness. Another one is to, to, to reduce the backlight time out. And I think Garmin comes at around 15 second backlight timeout, but you can change that, reduce it or increase it. And then you can turn off the screen automatically when the backlight times out. You can turn on battery save mode and you can use expedition mode. Now on the expedition mode, it will stop you from using certain functions that'll be on the screen here. I never use that, but if I were out on a two week or one week expedition, I might use that. The last thing is, and I actually just tested this, is if you use GPS mode rather than GNS mode. And if you just do that by itself, you'll get roughly nine, nine and a half days of your battery using the inReach technology and all that. You'll get around, I would say, two extra days, two and a half extra days rather than the GNS mode. The GNS mode, or the GNSS mode, sorry, it is more accurate, but it runs your battery down a little bit more. The bottom line on that one is you'll run the battery down around 15% per day on the GNSS mode versus around 11% per day on the GPS mode. So thought you might want to know about that. And I do have playlists and I have all this information in videos, so check that out and they'll be in the description below. Well, as I said, it's gonna be a short video and you can thank me later. But please like, subscribe, share, and turn on notifications so you'll be alerted as soon as I put out new videos. And if you'd like to support Hiking Emergency Beacon, there's a link in the description below. And I'll see you back out here in Colorado in the next video.